Hi everyone, I'm Caelan Burrows and this is a briefer history of the past. The sparkling wine, known as Champagne, may be synonymous with celebrating today, but when it was originally created, it was seen as flawed. In the 17th century, the winemakers in the Champagne region of France well, they were a bit jealous of the wines made by their neighbours to the south in Burgundy. I'm Ron Burgundy. You stay classy, San Diego. The Champs... Sh uh... Sh Champagnes? Champanese? What are they called? The Champenois? Attempted to rival the Burgundy wine quality, but due to their northern climate, the fermentation process would halt prematurely during the winter. The winter is coming. The yeast would remain dormant until the spring when it would warm up and start a second fermentation process. This released carbon dioxide gas, creating bubbles and a lot of pressure exploding many bottles, giving it the name the Devil's Wine. Please. Alcohol impairs judgement, why would the Devil make it undrinkable? Should have been called Jesus Wine. <laughs> what? What do you mean we're going to get emails? It is commonly believed that Pierre Perignon, also known as Dom Perignon, a Benedictine monk, created champagne. This, however, is not correct. As bubbles were seen as bad, he was actively trying to solve the problem, not create it. Though, I mean, he would later go on to make major contributions in the areas of quality and production for both still and sparkling wines. Like Dom Perignon, like the Champagne Company, <laughs> Sounds like they need to sue someone for taking their name, eh? The earliest documented sparkling wine was from an abbey near Carcassonne in 1531. Hey, hey, 1531. That, that's the same year that Henry VIII declared himself head of the Church of England. Yeah. I don't, I don't know what that has to do with champagne. I just thought it was interesting, that's all. <laughs> I mean, I bet he broke open a bottle or two, am I right? If you enjoy this video, please give it a like and a share. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to be notified when more Briefer History of the Past videos go up. Be sure to check out next week's full episode of A Brief History of the Past, all about chivalry. Thanks, and I'll see you all in the future.